Hello and welcome back to the Car Zone YouTube channel. I'm in Birmingham to check out this, the new Aura Funky Cat, which is a new electric compact car from Aura, which is a Chinese car brand that's part of the Great Wall Motors Group. It's expected in Ireland over the next few weeks and it's gonna go on sale priced from just under 32,000 euro, rising to just under about 40,000 euro for a top of the range model. There's gonna be two different battery sizes available and the range will vary from about 300 kilometers to just over 400 kilometers, depending on which version you go for. It's gonna go up against rivals such as small electric cars like the Fiat 500e, the Peugeot E208 and the Hyundai Kona Electric, as well as hatchbacks like the MG4, the Volkswagen ID3 and the new Renault Megane E-Tech. So in this video, we're gonna take a closer look at the new Aura Funky Cat to see what it has to offer and also take it for a drive. The Funky Cat has been designed as a compact hatchback and on video it might look like quite a small car but that's a little bit deceptive because this actually has the same footprint as a Volkswagen ID3. It's very similar in size. It's got a very cute retro inspired look. It's very distinctive. We have the new Aura logo, which is an exclamation mark. And then some really nice design details like these dimples in the front bumper. And then we also have these very charismatic circular LED headlights. At the back, there's a fully integrated light bar in the windscreen, which looks really impressive. 18 inch alloy wheels come as standard and there's the choice of a contrast white roof or a contrast black roof and there'll also be a GT package available at some point in 2023. I think this is a really stylish small car and they are positioning it more premium in the market. I really like this curvy rear end to it. We have a mid-mounted rear fog light, which is quite cool. It's a bit like an F1 car, a sporty bootlit spoiler. And then this is where the integrated light bar is, which is a really nice design detail. But let's check out the boot volume to see how practical is the Aura Funky Cat. A powered tailgate comes as standard on the more expensive version of the car that comes in at just under 40,000 euro with the larger battery. Now it's 228 litres, which I have to say is not really that impressive for a compact car like this. It's a bit more than a Fiat 500e, but a bit less than a Peugeot E208. And it's significantly less than an MG4 or a Volkswagen ID3 or a Renault Megane E-Tech. It's also quite a high lip on it, but you still will fit a few bags in here, it is practical, you can let down the rear seats and there's a little bit of underfloor storage as well. So when it comes to charging we have a CCS adapter as standard for all funky cats and DC fast charging is available up to about 67 kilowatt. It changes a little bit depending on which version you go for. So for example the 48 kilowatt hour battery version can charge up to 64 kilowatt so you could get an 80% charge in about 42 minutes. Or if you go for the version with the 63 kilowatt hour battery, it takes about 47 minutes to get to 80%. It charges at about 67 kilowatt. The good news is there's an 11 kilowatt onboard AC charger. So that'll mean AC charging will be that little bit faster where you have the right infrastructure. The doors open reasonably wide for good access to the back of the car. And this is where this funky cat really excels. It feels really spacious back here, I have to say. It is built on a dedicated EV platform, so we have really nice flat space. I have loads of room here, and headroom is good as well. Probably will only bother the very tallest of passengers, but children should be fine back here. And we do have Isofix anchors on the back seats. Here, there's also an armrest with two cup holders. 
So all in all, I think it does score well for space here in the back seat. Let's just pop into the middle. And that's reasonably comfortable. It will be tighter for uh, three to sit back here. But as I said, children should be fine. So inside the Aura Funky Cat feels like a really stylish and good quality small car. The interior build is very nice. Everything feels good, like the steering wheel. There's some lovely materials here in the dash and also these quilted leather seats and this quilting in the door panels as well. Now a black interior comes as standard, but I had a little look at that earlier and it does look nice, but I really like these two-tone interiors. They're an option. So there's some really nice combinations. This is the green and cream and it looks really good with this car color choice as well. It's very stylish. We have some very mini-esque buttons here and there's these two touch screens. Well, one touch screen and then a digital instrument cluster for the driver and a multifunction steering wheel. This car is loaded with tech, a really high specification. You get wireless smartphone charging as standard. There's a reversing camera. There's a 360 degree camera. So lots of very high end features come as standard on this car. It's also voice recognition, facial recognition, so that it can remember your settings and preferences for the car. It's really incredible in that regard. And also a lot of safety equipment as standard as well. And it's got a five star NCAP safety rating. So all in all, I really like the interior. I think it's very stylish. I think it's a good build and it does match that premium billing of the car. The Aura Funky Cat uses a 171 horsepower motor to send power to the front wheels and there's 250 Newton meters of torque. 0 to 100 kilometers per hour is just over 8 seconds and it goes on to a top speed of about 160 kilometers per hour. The car weighs only about 1500 kilograms so it's not particularly heavy for a compact electric vehicle like this one. So the handling is nice, it feels agile, it's great around town, it's a good size. There's a bit of lean in corners but generally it grips well and the steering is light but it gives you some good feel as well. It rides well for a compact electric vehicle. Goes over speed bumps nicely, I have to say. Maybe that's that premium edge to it. It is a little bit firm, so you can hear me going over those little potholes and things. But generally, I'm quite impressed with the ride, I have to say. It's got plenty of power when you want it, so there's no problem driving on motorways. But I did think that it could do with a little bit more refinement at high speeds on the motorway maybe a little bit more sound insulation because there was a fair bit of wind noise I'd like to be a bit more isolated from what's going on around me especially to match that more premium billing of the car in Ireland there's going to be two battery options for the Aura Funky Cat the range kicks off with the 48 kilowatt hour battery version and that goes on sale price from just under 32,000 euro and it's got a projected range of about 310 kilometers so that is a good option when you compare it to something like a well-spec Fiat 500e and a Peugeot e208 I think there it's a good comparison for those cars and it offers a little bit more high-tech features and also it's very spacious in the back as well. Then you can get the version with the 63 kilowatt hour battery and that's called the 400 Pro Plus. That's the one that comes in at just under 40,000 euro. So that kind of puts it in the arena of cars like the Volkswagen ID3 and the new Renault Megane E-Tech. And it has a projected range of 420 kilometers and it's got even more luxury features as standard. Of course, there's the MG4 that's just arrived in Ireland with a very low entry price and more range, but this car is billed as more premium, a more sophisticated car. So where can you buy this Aura Funky Cat? Well, it's a new brand to Ireland and the distributor is the IM Group, who have some history in distributing cars in Ireland. They were the distributor for Citroen for a while and 
they currently distribute Subaru cars in Ireland as well. There will be a dealership opening in Dublin over the next few weeks and that will be followed by locations in Cork and Galway and I've been told that they will be well-known dealers as well and customers will be able to take your first test drives from about December. The Aura Funky Cat will be arriving in Ireland over the next few weeks. There will be a dealership opening in Dublin in the next few weeks and that will be followed by locations in Cork and Galway. I think the Aura Funky Cat is going to be a great addition to that market for compact electric vehicles. It's something different, it's a new brand and certainly this is a car you probably buy because you really like the way it looks and then having more space in the back and lots of equipment is just a bonus of that. But primarily it's a design driven car I think. It is very nicely appointed inside, it's got that very spacious back seat. The boot is on the small side, there's no way really to gloss over that but it is bigger than some of those small electric city cars. So that's all from the cabin of the Aura Funky Cat. You can read a review of this car over on carzone.ie and the link is in the description below the video. Please like and subscribe if you'd like to see more videos like this. So thanks for watching and I'll see you soon.